Yeah, hello everybody. As you can see, we're doing a little bit of construction on the back of our chicken house here. The chicken house has been up for some time. Uh, we, uh, for quite a few years, we raised broilers in that, uh, basically for ourselves and for our neighbors here. But Beth, Beth noticed over the last few days that our two turkeys look like they're trying to nest. So, and they were in a small cage where it was pretty impossible to do that. So, uh, we've got Doro and Andoy today. Uh, building a cage for them. And we had a lot of netting left over uh, from when we had the chickens. And that's so uh, they're basically using the netting that we had. And of course, Beth's got her flowers in there and a good spot uh, for the nesting, too. So, and it looks like about 10 by 15 feet or so, uh, almost 10 by 20 feet. So it'll be a nice large area for them and they were in a pretty small cage so they're really going to enjoy this and of course we had to put a uh, a roof on it or they would definitely fly out of here and that uh, yeah looking real good we used to let them run free in the yard <laughs> and they wound up eating all the best flowers and my vegetables <laughs> and everything. So that didn't work. So we put them in a, in a cage, all that we had at the time. So, yeah, let's take a look at the two. They're over here on the other side. See if I can get around to them here. Hey, good afternoon. <laughs> Yeah, see here they are. They're oh, well, they're they're looks like they're kind of uh, shy here. But yeah, our two uh, turkeys. We used to have three. Lost one of them, got sick, and died. We still have the male, <coughs> which you can see with the beard, and of course the female and. Uh, it would be nice if uh, she had to start laying some eggs. Wouldn't mind that a bit. So now they've got a, a brand new home. And they're definitely, like I said, they're... Definitely going to love this. See if I can get them a little close here, but uh, there they are right there. So they've got a new environment now. In order to live in, so uh, like I said, I'm sure they're going to be happy as can be just picking through all the rice hulls uh, that we dumped in there. <clears throat> and we've been feeding them uh, just PDP, uh, which is a general uh, food for birds, the chickens, the ducks and everything else and that. So we're looking good. They're putting a little bit of a plastic cover on it now. And that, so I'll back up so we kind of get a view. But yeah, looking really good. And I know this is again something that was uh, down on our list. 
for quite some time and uh, it looks like uh, we barely we pretty much got caught up with a lot that we were doing uh, our garden is producing we're kind of wary now of planting too much more in case the dry season really does start here uh, because we've got no way to spray or irrigate uh, the plants and anything so uh, we're being cautious on the gardening side and on the farming side so it gives us an opportunity to do some of the other things uh, we've been wanting to get at and here's one of them here so I'll let you go we'll surely be back again soon like and subscribe and uh, thank you for viewing our videos